I need all Info Warriors, anyone in the Northeast, anybody in the Midwest, to go to Pittsburgh now with video cameras. The troops are bought and paid for by offshore banks. Republic is falling right now. They are openly bringing in martial law. They have troops deploying in every major city. We need everybody to go to Pittsburgh who loves this country. International media, government staffers, and protesters. The G20 uh, basically represent the largest nations which participate in the Western banking cartel, which I feel is behind a lot of the pain, anguish, and misery that exists in our world today. This is such a police state there that they tried to talk to the military and talk to a spokesman last night. Defense Link put a press release out, and they said, and they said no, we're not going to talk to you. Get out of here. Then, the, then they got their license number, had the police pose as Alamo rental car people from the county there, Allegheny County in Pennsylvania. They called them and said, oh, we've, your, your car's got no brakes. Bring it in. And they said, well, we're in the cordon at G20. We're news reporters. We can't get out till tomorrow. And they said, well, that's fine because I'm a police officer with the Army and FBI and you've all been put on terror list and your life's over, boy. And we know you're a terrorist and you were sneaking around the military base and ran. All lies. Okay, so I just went over. They're going to have a guy come out and talk to us or they said they'll get us a number to contact. Uh, he said the PAO. This is probably him right here. Briefly, tell folks about last night. You guys pull up to the gate. You asked to talk to the public information officer. They called the police and lied and said that you were sneaking around. Yes, sir. How's it going? Um, we were responding to a news story that the National Guard was going to be masked um, to go into Pittsburgh. And can we get a comment on that? We then pulled off to the side of the road where they instructed us to. We waited around 15 or 20 minutes. Uh, a representative came back immediately. He was hostile towards us. He did not like our credentials. Uh, we're out of uh, Austin, Texas, Channel 10. Katie, can I see your credentials? Um, we tried to get as much information as we could. He refused to answer our questions. So then uh, Rob asked him for his information and where we could contact him. Uh, tomorrow, if we could get a word with him, he then gave it, and we left. Speech, freelance reporter. Yes, sir. You guys have credentials for the G20? I can't. In the middle of the night, you come here tomorrow, we'll see what we can, if we can accommodate you. We're not going to. I mean, we only got a few questions, man. Yeah, we I'll, just have like four questions. I, the answer is no. I'm not going to comment. No, I'm not. That's okay. We're going to deny the interview. If you, if you get some credentials, you get some that I can work with, I'll do the uh, We didn't run away from anything. By the time that we had left, turned around, and exited the main military facility, there was another car uh, parked on the other side of the road, waited for us to pass, followed us for uh, an exit, then uh, got off. And then we were shot when uh, Douglas got a call trying to entrap him and have us go return our rental car for quote unquote two more free days. Uh, when we didn't fall for that, he then came clean and said he was actually military personnel and he wanted to know whether or not we were terrorists, Alex. And then he told Douglas, you're on a list now, pal, for the rest of your life. Yeah, he did. With pleasure. You ran from them. Is that true? Absolutely not. Good evening, my fellow Americans. We have been compelled to create a permanent armaments industry of vast proportions. Public policy could itself become the captive of a scientific, technological elite. Tyranny is here. The grim future foretold in 1984 has become reality. In the not too distant future. They're closing in. Already the Fed has been chosen. They said the market would drop by 4,000 points, blood would flow in the streets, and uh, lions would be devouring children in the parks of Los Angeles. That same story is just FBI training, but it was being... Do you believe that the military will fire on its people? Fire, fire, fire. And they're turning their guns on us! Already the Fed has been chosen by the lion said in Wilson decades ago. Decades ago, decades ago. Complete control. The police state isn't coming. It's here. Secure your copy today at InfoWars.com or see it online in the highest quality at PrisonPlanet.tv.